Hey guys, Patton here. Welcome back to Will It Run on the SNES Classic. So, so this request comes from Windsweep and Fidel Castro Solis. They both want to know if Crime Fighters for the arcade will run on the SNES Classic and Windsweep also wants to know if Dig Dug Arcade will run on the SNES Classic. So we're going to be looking at those. When you go to search for your games, you're going to be looking for digdug.zip revision 2 or for Crime Fighters, it's going to be crimefight.zip the world two players version. Once you search for those and you download them, you have them on your system. In your HackChi2 program, you're gonna click add more games. You're gonna to go to the folder where you have your games. So let's see, Crime Fight right there and Dig Dug Zip. I'm gonna open both of those. You're gonna get a file system. Click import as archive for both. All right, so first thing we wanna do is rename them. Crime Fighters Arcade. And Dig Dug Arcade. We're going to rename them so we can get some nice looking box art when we click Google right here. We'll do this first one and Dig Dug. Let's take a look. Also nice. Okay, so now we have our box art, we have our games. The next thing we need to do is install our modules. So in my description, I'll have a download link to KDFMK. In my description, I'll have a link to KMDF Manix Core Set, and also in my description, I will have a link to the request list for you to check out if there are any requests that you've made that are still pending. You can look at the status of those. So once you have the Core Set downloaded, you're going to go back to HackG2. You're going to go to your Modules tab right here. Click Install Extra Modules. You're going to drag the cores into this box right here. Both of these games run with the FBA 2016 core. So you're going to drag those into the box, they're going to populate on the list. If for some reason they don't, go into your HackG2 folder and then into your user underscore mods folder, drag them in there, or copy them in there, and that'll cause them to appear on the list here. So what we want was FBA 2012, not CBS, just regular FBA 2012. Also make sure you have the RetroArt Core installed as well. If you don't have that installed, none of these games will play. So. For FBA 2012, you make sure the box is checked. You're going to click OK. After you click OK, a box will appear on the screen asking you to hold down the select, or excuse me, hold down the reset button as you push the power button on your SNES Classic. After you do that, a bar will appear on the screen. It'll start filling up green. Once it's filled up all the way, that means that core is installed to your system and ready to go. So once you have the core installed, the next thing we have to do is change the command line here. So where you see slash bin slash zip, you're going to take out that zip. Add FBA 2016. And we have to do that for both games here. FBA 2016. Last thing you're going to do is click this synchronize button down at the bottom. That's going to transfer these games from your computer to your Super Nintendo Classic, and then you'll be all set. So let's head over to the SNES Classic, see how these games run. And here we are at our SNES Classic with Crime Fighters Arcade and Dig Dug Arcade. We're going to start with Crime Fighters first, so let's go in there. This game was requested by both of those users, so we're going to take a look at this one first. Ram Ram Check, Konami. How can you go wrong with Konami 1989? Crime Fighters. Coin up. It's one of those games where the more coins you put in, the more life you get. These girls have all been kidnapped. Big surprise by this fat toad. Go get them back and clean up the streets while you're at it. So we're going to rescue these girls and we're going to clean up. We've become janitors of the world. I guess we should kick him. Oh, oh, wait, hold on. Crime fighters. There we go. Now let's do it. Yes. That still wasn't enough. Wow, he took a lot of kicks too. And he's still standing. There we go. Got rid of that punk. And this one. Alright, so yeah, both of these games actually run really well. I didn't notice any slowdown or any sound issues. Oh dear, don't look, children. There we go. It's gone, and we got squished. And I want that bar over there. I'm not gonna... Oh, I am gonna... I'm gonna kick you out of anger. And then throw you. Excuse me, punk. The music at this one is kind of weird. It, it picks up sometimes and then like it, it'll be quiet other times. I don't know. I've never played this game. 
Oh, we almost did an overhead. Oh, elbow to the back. Oh, a knife. No, give me the... Oh, it's gone. And the toss. Are you covered with downtown insurance? Hey, that guy's dressed nicely for a punk. Look at that. Oh, never mind. He's got holes in his shirt. Never mind. That's not nice. For a second, I thought we were... We were working... Oh! Apparently I got hit somewhere sensitive. This guy's got the knife I want. We're very good at kicking. Look at this guy. He's all about fixing his hair as we fight. Allow me to fix your hair for you, sir. Come here. There you go. Oh, punched. So this is Crime Fighters. Regular. Kind of a weird, weird game. It, it, this, and it's from Konami, so like this is probably one of their first ones too. If I had to guess, this guy is taking me out with this bar, man. It's, the fighting's kind of funky. It's a uh, little takes takes some getting used to. Come here. How does your hair look? Oh, I can't kick him. Oh, but he left a knife for me. Wonderful. Yeah. And we lost it right away. That is how knives work in this game. There we go. Yes. Sir, excuse me. Your stomach didn't look like it had enough holes in it. Oh, we have a big one. Hello, sir. And a bar over there. Maybe I'll take the bar instead. I think I like the bar. Oh, sub. Our train's here. Excuse me. I have to go. I have to. No. Oh, wow. King of the Mohawks. And a spike club. Wow, that, that swing is, um, that's something else there, guy. I'm, I'm very scared of that swing. I can't hit, I can't hit Biggins over here either. He's dodging me like a, like a boss. Oh! Alright, maybe I can kick him. Nope. No! Biggins is showing us how it's done. He doesn't like knives, though, I bet. Yeah, there we go. And that guy, he knocked a knife out of my hand. What is he doing? Yeah, now you're winded. That's what you get for windmilling. Now I can't get out of this because I'm right next to him. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. This is something else. I don't know what to make of this. This is the weirdest boss fight I think I've ever been in. It's, it's kind of effective. I mean, I can't attack him when he's doing it, so I just have to wait. I wish I had my bar. Come here, you. And then he just starts right back up again. And I'm stuck. Maybe I can do a jump kick. I'm afraid he'll knock me out, though. How about some kicks? Jump kick was not effective. Maybe now. Nope. Can't get in there. Not with the jump kicks. Super combo him. Use your invincibility frames that you don't have. This is... Okay, we got him. We got Spike. Celebration kicks. Yeah, 5k. I like 5k. And we're on the bus. Goodbye, 13th Street. Says Konami. I think I'm done with that one. Let's give Dig Dug a try. I played a little bit of this. I love that opening screen. All the flashing. That's great. I didn't play this in the arcade. I think I played it in... Not Nintendo, because it never came out for Nintendo. It had to have been in an arcade version, yeah. Not in an arcade, though. It was somewhere, probably like a laundromat or whatever. What's cool about this game is there's no music until you move. That's so cool. I don't know why I like that so much. Then you gotta pump up these bad guys. And there's one coming up here. Two coming at me. Oh, the strategy. Not good enough, unfortunately for you. And there's a dragon we have to take care of. 
Oh, are you trying to escape, little dragon? No, you won't do that. Hey, come here. Gotcha! See what happens when there's one enemy left. They like to try and go up to the top to escape. That's not gonna work. So let's take him out. The objective is to get rid of all the bad guys. So that's, that's what we're, we're here to do. We are, I don't know if our name is Dig Dug. Maybe we're just Dug, you know, and, and we're here to dig and take out bad guys like that with style. So there you go. That was Dig Dug and Crime Fighters Arcade. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for the request, Windsweep and Fidel Castro Solis. Um, if there's any games you want to request, feel free to leave a comment, email me, or get me on Twitter, and I will do my best to get it to run. So thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time.